Hello and welcome to, I think, Croc Vlog 35, weekly 35. Um, oh yeah, look at this, shaved. First time I've been this clean shaven, it's not even clean shaven, but the beard is gone for the first time in a few mo months now. Um, I just decided to completely get rid of it. But not only that, but also the body hair and, and everything. Look at the state of it. Um, the top, though, is still a complete mess. I trimmed around the ears a little bit, but I've got a few more weeks until I can have a proper haircut. Anyway, a good week um, ahead is looking like. First of all, incredible weather, so sitting outside doing my work in the sun. Workout complete today. It's a special time. Do you know why? Because, because that is Home Fit 1 complete. Look at all those blue circles. Home Fit 1 complete, 100% done. Every workout of Home Fit 1. And just as so I finish that, I get an email from Test Flight to test the Croc app on iOS before everyone else. So yeah, perfect timing. Finished Home Fit 1 and Home Fit 2 is about to be launched in the latest update. Straight into a leg day today. Whilst I'm rehabbing my knee, I'm trying to just get as much work done as possible. So being nice to the knee, whilst also get burning out quads, hamstrings, calves, glutes, getting these puppies stable is a tough job. Um, and a lot of people out there are injured. Number one is rehab. And number two, keep on training and be clever with your exercise um, selection so you can work the muscles without making things worse. Right, it's Tuesday morning. Really enjoying my morning routine at the moment. Um, whilst I go out for a walk, enjoy a coffee, um, go through a little mindfulness routine. And basically what I'd go for is um, I spend a few minutes just thinking about all the things that I'm grateful for. And then when I finish that, I then start thinking about um, all the things that I want to achieve. And then after that, I then think about the day that I'm on and three big tasks that I need to achieve. And that really sets me up for my day. What I feel that I do need, though, is just a little bit more sleep. I'm really loving getting up at 6 a.m. But if you look in the Fitbit app, which is sleep tracked from the Fitbit, of course, you'll see today was 7 hours 12, Monday was 7, hour, seven and a half hours. So I would love to see that at 8 so we're getting up at 6 a.m. So really I need to be in bed at 9 rather than 9.30. So that's my task this week to try and improve that. Feels weird to drive, not driving much these days with lockdown, but just driven to come and help my dad move a few things that he couldn't do by himself. As um, I think we've got some big sofas and wardrobes to move. Hello. Hello. Wow, it's empty. <laughs> hello. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Unfortunately though, I wasn't allowed to hug or get close to my dad. Not yet. I can't wait for lockdown to end. Well, not lockdown, but allowed to really hug your family and friends and stuff like that. Anyway, exciting morning because it's the first time I'm having a chiropractic appointment since lockdown. They've opened up West Chiropractic just by my house. Um, I'm expecting to be like one in one out scenario using mask and gloves etc so um, but either way I'm looking forward to having my body treated see you later bye bye see ya <laughs> received a massive delivery any guesses what this is new garden furniture to sit out in the sun and yeah, guess sit on the yeah gonna sit on the sofa in the sun but guess who the first person is to find a new comfortable spot? Pickles. Two sofas, two chairs, and a table. And a naked man sunbathing. This is perfect. Afternoon session in the sun, focusing on chest and shoulders, using some dumbbells and bands, just getting a big pump on. This is their favourite time, Licky Licks. Not sponsored by Licky Licks yet, but we're working on it. Oh, it makes them so happy. 
feeding time. Good morning, it is Wednesday and we have done the morning walk. Got my coffee, got my green smoothie, got the cuddles with pickles and um, sleep was better. Went to bed at 9.45, probably slept about um, 10 o'clock and woke up at 6.15. So about seven and a half hours sleep on the Fitbit and still feel sleepy. So I think I could get to bed half hour earlier again, but much better than last week. Lunches this week, eggs, egg whites and veg. Exciting training session today. The Home Fit 2 plan is launched in the app. For anybody that has Home Fit 2, uh, previously purchased then make sure you download the app or update the app to version 1.7 and you'll see HomeFit 2 appear. If you finished HomeFit 1 and you want HomeFit 2 then go ahead and get it. We just started on session 1 and it was a fitness te test day. Lots of squat jumps, lots of burpees, although I didn't do squat jumps I just did standard squats looking after my knee and good session done as well as a nice 13, well 14,000 steps. And I use that burn, that fire figure at the bottom, as a gauge, an estimate of how many calories that I'm burning in the day. I aim to get at least 3,000 calories burnt in the day and then eat 2,500. That's a 500 calorie deficit. And these are just estimated numbers, but it's a good guide to live each day. And I think each day uh, for me and being on a fitness journey, it's really useful to have mini tasks like this. How many steps a day? How many calories a day? How many um, calories do I need to burn a day? The little jobs, little tasks, little goals each day to make the big picture come true in whatever your fitness journey is. Baxter, get inside. So for convenience and ease, most of our dinners are from um, recipe companies like Mindful Chef and HelloFresh. Keeps things fresh with variety. And tonight is trout greens and coconut rice. Today I just filmed a 10 minute morning stretch routine. Had my positions up there on the whiteboard and just enjoyed a follow along stretch. So if you wanna do it, then make sure you look out for it on my channel. Um, got quite a lot of stretch routines on my channel. So if you do fancy um, increasing your flexibility and having a good stretch, then check those out. We are in the final month of my CrocFit charity campaign and so it's been going for three months and basically my home bit one plan is 99p and each month I choose a different charity. We're in the final month which is June and there's a lot going on right now with Black Lives Matter with the current climate and conversations happening. So instead of putting out a vote uh, for which charity to choose this month, I'm just going ahead and making all the proceeds of my HomeFit One plan um, go to support Black Lives Matter this month. So if you haven't got the HomeFit One plan, then go ahead and get it for 99p on my website or in the CrocFit app. And those proceeds will all go uh, to a good cause uh, at this time. So happy Friday morning. Just went live on Instagram, live workout. Hope you're enjoying, come on, focus, focus, yes. Hope you're enjoying those live workouts. If you're missing them, then that was actually a joint one with my friend James on his channel. But I think I'm going to continue Instagram live workouts on Wednesday nights, 6 p.m. UK time. Hopefully that works for you wherever you are um, in the world. If not, then they'll be posted on IGTV for you to do afterwards. I've done really well this week with adjusting my slip, my, <coughs> my sleep routine. <laughs> Can't talk today. Um, so what I mean is going to bed earlier so then I can get up early without impacting my sleep quality. So we've had some good times this week. 7.26, 7.8, 7.52 7 this morning. And that was look, 9.37 to 6.33. That's a good sleep. I want to show you a sneak peek of something that no one has seen and this is the very first time I'm talking about it, a brand new website. Um, basically my website for CrocFit is from 2015, it's old, it's selling my PDF plans but now with the app, it's all about the app, I've got to start this long transition of getting rid of the old website and PDF purchases and building a new website that focuses entirely on the app and app downloads. Not selling anything on the website is purely informational. So this is the first time I'm showing anyone, um, but it's looking slick so far. We've got that video there. We've got lots of information about the app, um, gym training, home training, and all about the plans in here. But to be honest, I have a few edits 
and adjustments to go in photos and things like that but pretty much almost there and then I'm going to launch it and have two websites running at the same time until I get rid of all the well until I have all the CrocFit programs in the app which may take for the rest of the year and some of next year and then I'll delete and get rid of the current website and then focus on this one so that's been a big project this week and tied it to it oh my god okay DIY. proper proper diy going on here yeah that one is yeah yeah i'm still filming so oh, if you, sorry if you guys are wondering what the hell <laughs> we're talking about basically i just finished a, uh, a home fit workout i filmed it as well so make sure you go check it out sarah has been creating an outdoor play area <laughs> my den this is your adult den who else created dens when they were younger this is an adult den now the reason is is because there's some of these very special 30th birthday next weekend and the forecast is looking miserable and i think sarah has invited some people around but because of oh hello pickles because of coronavirus we're not allowed to have them inside so, bad weather and only outside, Sarah has created a roof, but proper DIY going on here. Wish us luck. It's been a fun afternoon of making content. I enjoyed that workout um, and filming it for YouTube, and then I did some TikToks. Take a look at this one. This one's been on my mind for ages. Look at the saucepan. Who loves Avengers? <laughs> bloody love avengers uh, if you're not following me on tiktok then please do some funny funny videos really enjoying the creativity part that one was actually really hard to think about like it's in reverse it's fast um so it took me some time to actually figure out which i'm enjoying that process as well all right happy sunday final day of the vlog pre-workout is in reflex nutrition muscle bomb because it's such a beautiful oh the heavens have just opened up and it's pouring down with rain. I was about to do an outdoor workout. Looks like I'm going to have to do an indoor workout today. Session complete. Did session three of the home, come on. I did session three of the Home Fit 2 training program, um, which I've posted on Instagram. And then additional abs. I was absolutely starving after that workout. I haven't eaten much today, so I've got my post-workout Shake here, unsweetened almond milk, plant based protein, oats, and frozen blueberries. Have it every single day after workout with some creatine and L glutamine. Um, one thing I want to talk about after I've taken a few sips of this is the launch of my CrocFit Summer Challenge. The first time I've ever done this because I do something different every year, really. But basically, it's someone's very special birthday as I mentioned before, on the 15th of June. So what I thought I'd do is, I know that I'm gonna be super motivated for a month, at least, after I eat lots of rubbish on my birthday. 15th of June is a Monday. So that's when the, this challenge begins. What is the challenge, you ask? Basically, all you have to do is complete one month of your CrocFit plan in a space of one month. Nothing crazy, and all you gotta do is be consistent. So what I'll be asking people to do is screenshot inside their app, whatever plan they're doing, whether it's home fit, gym fit, or she fit, and if you're wondering, well, I don't have a CrocFit plan, the home fit plan is 99p, and I made it 99p because I wanted to make everyone available to do it um, during this coronavirus time and also giving all those proceeds to charity. So there's a plan for everyone. Um, all you gotta do is commit to those 30 days, be consistent, uh, send me a screenshot at the beginning and at the end um, on 15th of July and you'll be up for winning um, a variety of prizes from your next CrocFit plan to reflex nutrition supplements, Under Armour clothing, um, a Fitbit and much more for the next week. I'm trying to talk to companies um, about getting prizes involved and stuff like that. So keep a lookout. Um, by the time that my next vlog comes out, it'll be too late really because it'll be Sunday slash Monday. So yeah, this is where I'm launching it, but keep a lookout on my Instagram for updates as well. Um, this is gonna be fun. I just really wanna help people stay consistent and motivated. I believe my app is pretty motivating as it is already, but knowing that everybody's gonna be in a challenge together to do 30 days in 30 days is gonna be uh, motivating that we're all doing it together and bringing that community vibe 
um, a lot closer together. So please let me know if you're going to get involved. And if you are, then take a screenshot of inside the app on the 15th of June and then get ready to work hard. Okay, that brings us to the end of the vlog. Finishing up the day with finishing the walks. Every day this week, getting 10 to 15,000 steps a day, normally 13, 14, 15,000 steps a day, all helping with strengthening the knee and also keeping the calorie burn up so I can eat more food. We're probably gonna go to Tesco and get some chocolate to finish off the week. Mm. <laughs> On that note, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.